Hello friends, welcome to Programming Knowledge. My name is Prijan and in our last video we integrated our Technics app with API. So currently the data are coming from the news API. So in this video we will create a bottom tab navigator. We have uh, mainly two screen in our app. The one is the home screen where we display all the articles. And the second one is the search screen where user can search for a specific topic. So React Native doesn't have any built-in navigation system. So we need to install a library. So open your browser and type React Navigation. Go to React Navigation. Okay, here in getting started. You need to uh, install the React Native, React Native Navigation Library for it. So far you can use NPM or you can use YARN. So I'll be using NPM. So you just need to copy the command. Open your text editor and open a terminal. And just paste the command. It will install React Navigation. Since we are also using Expo Manage Project, we also need to install the other dependencies. So you just need to copy this. Wait for it to install. Okay, it installed successfully. So let me just paste the another command. Okay, since we are using expo project, so we have uh, installed this expo directory. Now you need to go to the guides and here you need to go to the tab navigation. Here to use the uh, tab navigation, we also need to install bottom tab. Just copy this. Okay, all the dependencies have successfully installed. Now, if you go to the example over here, here we can see the example that they have created. Here they have a home screen and setting screen. Right now we only have a home screen. So, we need to create another screen that we can display in the tab navigation. Just right click on the screens and create a new file. Let's name it search screen. Yes. Let's import react. Also import view from React Native. Here we will return a view component. Let's add a text subscreen. So 
also import the text component let's export our component export default subscreen let me just save this now go to the highest hierarchy in your app which is app.js in this case here we need to import some uh, elements we need to import navigation container and create bottom tab navigator so let me just copy this paste it over here now if you see over here all the tabs are encapsulated in tab.navigator which is encapsulated in navigation container so we need to create a navigation container first so let me just copy this much and paste it over here then we can copy this so we will not render the home screen directly let me just remove this view component okay so the name will be home and the component will be home screen it means that uh, whenever you uh, need to go to any uh, uh, different screen that is present in the navigator we can use this name to navigate over there and the component that we need to render for it is home screen and the another one will be search and we need to import this search screen okay let me just save this okay so as you can see uh, we have successfully implemented our tab navigation our scrolling is working fine currently we are in home screen and if we go to the search here is our search screen we only have a text component over here search so let's just customize this uh, bottom uh, navigation a little bit if you go to the example you can customize the appearance it has multiple options for it you can go through the all the options in the documentation so here in navigation container we have this tab navigator and this tab dot screen so first of all we need to apply the styling for the whole navigator so we use tab dot navigator and here we can provide the tab bar options tab bar active tint color so let me provide red if i press as you can see whenever a tab bar is active the color is changed to red this is how you can provide a uh, separate colors you can also provide inactive tab color just like over here okay so let me just uh, uh, apply the tab bar icon to individual component we can also add icons over here so let's just do that for that we need to type the options here we can specify the tab bar icon we can also specify the name but right now let's specify tab bar icon For the icon we can use the expo vector icons just go to the expo vector icons search for home let me just use this copy this paste it over here now we can use this icon Now let me just save this.
as you can see we have successfully uh, changed the icon to our home let's also provide icon over here Okay, by icon here we can search for let's say search we can use this one copy this paste it let me actually just copy this much and copy this icon let me space this over here let me now as you can see we have our home icon and our search icon so these are how you can uh, apply the icons to bottom tab navigation you can change the styling you can also disable this text icon you can go to the documentation and see uh, what other methods uh, you can use to customize this so in our next video we will complete our search screen so thanks for watching